steady eddy here. This time I'm taking a walk through Central Bangkok. I've walked along Sukhumvit from Nana all the way to this area here. Can't remember what it's called. But there is that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful tower up there. You can see it poking over the Novotel. Gorgeous building. So if you come up to the top of Nana, you can actually see that tower in the distance. And that's how far I've walked. No particular reason. It's a lovely, lovely sunny day. Scorching as normal. And I think I, I've got an idea that there's some nice little nice little restaurants up here where I can get a nice meal. Check it out. Not for me, thank you, mate. Let's have a walk. Well, Tuk Tuk's don't seem to be very busy today. You know, it's a bit of a myth that, you know, that Bangkok is full of Tuk Tuk's. There isn't that many of them around, not really. You know, not really. I mean, it's how many Tuk Tuk's to a car or how many cars to a Tuk Tuk? What a big line of traffic there. Maybe in the olden days there were loads of tuk tuk but you know, not so much now. to the area where you get the boats so if you want to get a boat around uh, Bangkok it's I've done it a few times it's good fun you can go to a nice little variety of locations in fact I think you can get a pass where you can spend all day on them Now this area here looks like it's got some really, really nice little restaurants, cafes, call them what you want. But I don't know if I've actually eaten there before, so there's a first time for everything. Oh, wow. Doesn't look like some lovely stuff there. Okay, take a look in a moment, mate. Hello. Sure looks like some scrumptious stuff here. Dragon, seafood and shark fin. No, I don't approve of shark fin. I don't want any of that. Last time I had shark fin soup, I wasn't aware how much controversy it caused. You know, I wouldn't have it again. Definitely not. Now, this is a nice shot here. Just look at this here. Wow, what a beautiful building that is. Isn't that a gorgeous building? Absolutely lovely. Very, very busy traffic in Bangkok today. Now this here is where you get the boats. If you like that sort of thing, I love boats, beautiful. You can have a pass and you can go all kinds of places. Okay, so these are the various stops. You've got the old town, Klong Bangla Fomfu Pier, Fanfa Bridge Pier. A lot of interesting places. I've done this one a couple of times and it's great fun. They're very, very noisy and, well, they're very noisy, but they're good fun anyway. Okay, so I'm heading up this way because there's a little place that I've seen before. Been it's a very very much a locals place but I've got an idea that it's really really cheap now it's not that I'm just after the cheapest food possible it's simply that I, I would like to see you know Bangkok how cheap Bangkok can, uh, can be you don't necessarily have to spend a lot of money in order to eat here okay let's get through here and it's this place here 
There's all kinds of stuff going on there. There's coffee and... Do you have beer? 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 Oh, you don't sell beer? No, 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 no. You don't sell any of that? Oh, well, I wanted a beer. I'm going to have a beer first, okay? And then I'll come back, okay? Well, I have to have a nice beer to, you know, for my meal, don't I? So, it's the next option, isn't it? Okay, so that place went out of the window. I really, really, really need a nice cold beer to start the day before I eat anything. So, I think I'm going to offer the more expensive one, the Dragon, okay? There we go, I'm going to enter the Dragon. What have we got here? Ah, no, this looks good. This is beer. Small, 90, large, 120. No, that seems reasonable enough. So a large Heineken for 120. That'll do for me. Okay, that will do for me. Quite often when, you know, you've got your heart set on a large Heineken, they say they haven't got it. So, so many of these have never got the stuff you want or the stuff that's on the menu. But I think I'm getting a large singer anyway, for 120 baht. So that'll be nice. As long as it's cold, it'll do the trick. Oh, look at that there. Wow. That looks beautiful. That looks beautiful. Ready, ready. Really good. Brilliant. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, first cold beer of the day. Sweltering day like this. Oh, lovely stuff. Beautiful. I'm not normally a fan of singer. I actually think Leo was the best of the Thai beers. But that'll do. That does the trick nicely. Okay, so I eventually opted for, looks nice in the picture, 23. That is shrimp tom yum noodles, 100 bar. Yes, sounds good. Now I wanted it with, I wanted it with French fries, which is 100 bar. You know, East meets West, but they haven't got any French fries. So I'm going to have it with fried rice with pork, yeah? So that should be 170 baht overall. So having just visited the bathroom up here, I can see that this is actually quite a big place. The Dragon Restaurant. There we go, this is the upstairs of it. Looks like it holds quite a few people. Nice sailing ship there. So it's obviously a very, very nicely established place. And there is of course downstairs seating indoors as well.
certainly is a fair sized restaurant. Well, two different levels. There we go, it's dinner time. Now look at this here. Whoa, oh, magnificent. <laughs> so that's fried rice with pork and tom young with shrimp. Lovely stuff. Say by this lovely lady here. Okay, <laughs> lovely lady. Thank you. There we go. I've got a sneaky, sneaky feeling that I'm going to enjoy this. Fried rice with pork is lovely. Really, really tasty stuff. Mmm, lovely. Very, very nice. Love it. Okay, now to try the Tom Young with or the Tom Young with shrimp. Looks nice. Now this is really tasty, nice and spicy, not too hot, but it's going down really, really well. Lovely stuff. Oh, look at that there, beautiful. Lovely stuff. Even the actual soup itself is very, very spicy and tasty. Mm. Beautiful, lovely stuff. Mm. Lovely. Oh, well, that went down well. That was lovely, that was. I mean, that was. Oh, well, yeah, well, there, there you go. That was the fried rice with pork lovely that was and that was the tom yum with shrimp it was i mean the shrimps were nice the actual soup itself was lovely the, the noodles were nice there were some very very strange enigmatic things in there that caused me to almost choke it's a good word that isn't it enigmatic kind of roll rolls up the tongue doesn't it like but yeah lovely stuff anyway Tom Young soup with shrimp, fried rice with pork. I'm kind of glad in the way that he didn't have any French fries because that would have been cheating. That would. That was. I'm getting the way now. You know, authentic Thai stuff. That was lovely. I really, really enjoyed that. Total meal: 170 baht. 120 baht for each large single bear. I'd say that that's bloody good value. So that's two large bears a fried rice with pork and a lovely tom yum soup with shrimp total of that was 410 thai baht which is about nine and a half quid in english money and I'd, I'd say that that is a bloody good deal authentic thai food nice cold bear even thai bear lovely stuff really really enjoyed that that is the dragon restaurant well worth a visit Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, it was lovely that anyway. Have a nice day. Thank you, bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, so this is where it's located. Ratchet Army. There's that beautiful big tower there. And that is the dragon seafood and shark fin okay well we won't go into the shark fin bit of it because that's a little bit too controversial but anyway there it is a lovely meal lovely authentic thai stuff and i'd say that that was, that was all right that i really really enjoyed that okay so back to nada <laughs>